I am Andrew, and today we are discussing Finney's and Fur. And by that, I mean a board game called Best Treehouse Ever, where you build a gigantic treehouse with all these wacky and Phineas and Fur blade balloons. Like, how do you put a bowling alley in a treehouse? A bowling alley? How will that fit? Anyways, so you start by, by passing out six cards. Hard. So each kill, so each player will get six cards, and you won't be. And each each player, like I said, will get three. Now let's say, and at the beginning of every turn, turn you pick one, and then you put it down like this. And once everybody's picked their card, you flip it and put it here. So if it goes here, the acorn goes from here to here, and if you put it on the opposite side, it'd go from here to here. Now, I should quickly address how these different rooms work. So, let's say you put the cannot exist in a treehouse bowling alley here, here, and then you put the dinosaur exhibit here. Well, then, that means you can only place yellow and red. So, if you want to do something here, it has to be a red, because only he stuff of the same color can attach to it. Now, if you do this, this is for your next turn, and then do this to balance it out, which, fair, here, then you can't place down any more yellows because your yellows are closed off, so you can't place any more down. Then, at the end of every turn, you get... These for every color, these little things right here. Now, let's say you put this on it. Well, then instead of giving hanging one point on this little, little soccer field, you'll then your piece of like that looks like this would go not only not two because we have two, but four because it's been double. The amount has been double. No, but instead, let's say you do this. Well, then the points. They don't count, and you don't move up any point points. And then, is there anything else? Also, I should just quickly address that this game is kind of simplistic. And I think if you have a younger sibling that wants to play a board game, this one would be a pretty good starter point. Because it's easy, it's quick, and it's just fun to play. And think that you're actually doing Phineas and Ferb. Um, I, bye.